Hello friends, welcome to N Universe Double Two. In this video, we will try to solve the numerical that is based on U two manometer, and the case is negative pressure. So, firstly, I read the statement: A U two manometer containing mercury was used to find the negative pressure in the pipe. So, here we can the we can say in the statement the mercury that is in the manometer and mercury is the heavy liquid. and in the pipe that containing the water water in the pipe the right limb was open to the atmosphere basically there are the two limbs in the manometer right limb and left limb so according to statement the right limb of the manometer that is open to the atmosphere find the vacuum pressure in the pipe if the difference of mercury level in the two limbs one is right and second is left and the difference between these two limb was 100 mm and the height of water in the left limb from the center of the pipe was found to be 50 mm below so firstly we try to draw a diagram on the basis of the given statement so in the statement that is given the water that is in the pipe and mercury that is in the manometer so here i try to plot the diagram according to the given parameters so this is the u tube manometer and it's a right limb that is open to the atmosphere and this pipe contain the water so this is the negative pressure so in case of negative pressure this is mercury in the manometer so i take up to this point this is a mercury and this is the one end of the mercury this is the second end of the mercury and this is the phase that is open to atmosphere and this is water and it is mercury so here the right limb was open to the atmosphere and uh, the difference of mercury level in two limb was 100 mm so the difference level is given this is the upper end and it is lower end and this is the distance of mercury level that is denoted by h2 and it is equal to 100 mm that is given difference of mercury level and the height of water in left limb from center of pipe was found to be 50 mm below so here this is the center of the pipe and up to this point so this is the height of water that is h1 equal to 50 mm this is given so so this is the diagram from the diagram and according to statement we can say this is the example of the negative pressure because in negative pressure there is no mercury above the datum line so this is the datum line x x and above datum line in the right limb there is zero head so now we try to solve this numerical so firstly solution and write the given variables so specific gravity of water so this is first one so that is s1 this is equal to 1 so s1 is the specific gravity for water so firstly we know about what is specific gravity basically is the specific gravity 
that is equal to density of liquid upon density of standard liquid so in case of standard uh, in case of liquid the standard liquid that is water water is the standard liquid so if i write here i have the water in the pipe so density of uh, right now i have the water so density of water that is 1000 kg per meter cube and divide by density of the standard liquid so in case of liquid the standard liquid is water so the density of water that is again kg per meter cube so when we are getting that is equal to 1 and basically it is the unitless quantity or oh, that's why this is s1 equal to 1 now the specific gravity second we have the mercury so s2 now the specific gravity for mercury that is s2 so that is how much that's not given so we try to solve it mercury is also also liquid so that is equal to density of mercury upon density of standard liquid so a standard liquid that is water so the density of mercury that is 13600 kg per meter cube and density of water that is 1000 kg per meter cube so that is equal to 13.6 so that is s2 13.6 so now we write here h1 that is equal to 50 mm that is 0.05 meter this is the height of water in left limb and h2 that is equal to 100 mm this is 0.1 meter this is height of mercury in left limb so now we need to get h so h this is let h it is the pressure head in pipe in terms of head of water and that is below the atmosphere so for getting this uh, the value of h we need to equating the pressure head above the datum line on both sides then we get now equating the pressure head above datum line x x then we get so here we can say above the datum line the pressure head in right hand side that is h plus h1 into s1 plus h2 into s2 that is equal to 0 because there is no head above this x x or datum line in the right limb so then we get h plus h1 s1 plus h2 s2 that is equal to 0 and from here h equal to minus h1 s1 plus h2 s2 and substitute the value of this parameter 
एच वन दैट इज जीरो पॉइंट जीरो फाइव एस वन दैट इज वन प्लस एच टू दैट इज जीरो पॉइंट वन इन टू एस टू दैट इज थर्टीन पॉइंट सिक्स सो एर वी गेट माइनस जीरो पॉइंट जीरो फाइव प्लस वन पॉइंट थ्री सिक्स दैट इज इक्वल टू माइनस वन पॉइंट फोर वन मीटर ऑफ वाटर सो नाउ प्रेशर इज गिवन बाय पी इक्वल टू दैट इज स्पेसिफिक वेट इन टू एच दैट इज रोजी एच सो दैट इज इन नेगेटिव प्रेशर सो दैट इज इन नेगेटिव रो वन थाउजेंड दैट इज नाइन पॉइंट एट वन इन टू वन पॉइंट फोर वन सो दैट इज इक्वल टू थर्टीन थाउजेंड एट हंड्रेड एट्टी टू नेगेटिव दैट इज न्यूटन पर मीटर स्क्वेयर सो वी कैन राइट इट दैट इज माइनस थर्टीन पॉइंट एट टू किलो न्यूटन पर मीटर स्क्वेयर और दैट इज माइनस थर्टीन पॉइंट एट टू किलो पास्कल एंड वी कैन ऑल्सो राइट इट दैट इज थर्टीन पॉइंट एट टू दैट इज किलो पास्कल दैट इज वैक्यूम सो दिस इज द फाइनल आंसर सो फ्रेंड्स इफ यू लाइक दिस वीडियो प्लीज शेयर विद योर फ्रेंड्स एंड स्टूडेंट्स Don't forget to subscribe any universe double two. Thanks for watching. Have a nice day.